I am done talking about this. I don't know what to tell you. What are we even doing? You're never around, Scott. We bought this house so we could make it a home. We talked about having kids. I'm never around because somebody's got to pay for this house of ours. Go on. Get it. Lord knows it's a hell of a lot more important than what's going on here. You wanted this house. You have it. You wanted to take some time off so you could focus on your music. You have it. What else do you want from me? You were the one who told me to stop working and focus on my music. I just wanted to be more active in it. I never said I wanted to quit my job. Then why did you? No. Don't you do that. Don't turn this around on me. God, you always do that. You make a decision and I go along with it and then later you use it against me. It's bullshit. I'm not using anything against you. I don't even know what this is. It's like every time that we talk lately, you turn it into an argument. What do you expect? You're never around. And when you are, you're a complete asshole. And I'm sorry the house isn't clean enough for this you. This place ain't clean at all. You know, I'm still trying to figure out what the hell you do all day. Do you want to have kids? What? Do you want to have kids? At some point, yes. And when is that exactly? Because you've been saying that for the last five years. With the way that we've been interacting lately, do you really think having a kid is a good idea? We can talk everything in circles like we always do. The problem is I can never get a solid answer from you. Fine. No. I don't want to have kids. Is that a solid enough answer for you? Thank you. For the first time ever, you're actually being honest. What are you talking about? I am always honest with you. You're the one who seems to have all the secrets lately. Like your bank account? You're looking into my personal bank account? What, you're spying on me now? Where's all that money going? Because it certainly isn't going anywhere around here. It's none of your goddamn business. It is my business. I'm your husband. Really? I can't do this anymore. Yeah, just threaten to leave again. I mean, you threaten to leave at least once a month. You know, honestly, Stace, I am sick and tired of even entertaining that possibility.